Hi, Chris Pippen here. We're continuing on with our mini home series. Uh, what I wanted to show you today was uh, we, were, we were here, we were having an appraisal, and one of the things the appraiser needs to see are those hurricane straps that we talked about in our other video. So, um, what happened was we had to go under the house and we had to remove a piece of the skirting so that they could get in and they could actually grab a glimpse of, you can't see it, of the hurricane strap. But what happens is this skirting is made from vinyl siding and at the bottom down here this piece is what we would call J channel so it's essentially a, uh, uh, just a catchment for the bottom of the siding well in the winter time when there's inclement weather or when it gets wet snow builds up in here and here and ice forms um, it makes it really hard to move this around and it's plastic and basically you can see the result of trying to move it when it's plastic. So, um, moral of the story here is when uh, you're trying to remove your skirting, you should be very careful in the cold weather. But more importantly than that, a little forethought on part of the owner. When they're having the skirting put in by the professional, really should be making an access hatch, a proper access hatch. Um, at some point in the structure so that this type of uh, accident doesn't happen. So um, something to look for when you're buying a home, look for access hatches. And the other really important thing, just real quick, are vents. Make sure the mini home that you're buying has lots of vents in the skirting, the more the better, because you have to have a way of letting moisture out from underneath the house uh, in the appropriate times of the year. Those have to be opened and closed. Uh, depending on what time of year it is. So, again, I'm Chris Pittman. I hope you found this helpful, and uh, you can come visit us online at sellingfrederton.com. Thanks. Have a great day.